hey what's up i'm back again yes you have to see my face again because i'm gonna talk about this shit all right but um i was on youtube scrolling and you know it's the talk of the town that you know a lot of people well i wouldn't say a lot of people but you know there are some people that are um doing a response video to fantasia saying that women need to be submissive to their husbands and you know what you know i'm i'm really i'm really starting to get you know an eerie vibe about this whole submission thing submission thing because why is it that black men, it's only black men that are going around saying that they want their wives and they want their women to be submissive to them? Like, first of all, if you're naturally a masculine man and you're confident in your masculine in your masculinity and you already know how to deal with women, you know how you treat women, you don't have to go around saying that you need a woman to submit to you. You don't have to go around saying that you want you want a submissive wife. You know what I'm saying? You don't hear white men or or, or or other races of men saying that they want their women to be submissive to them. They know that their women are going to be submissive to them. So why would they need to constantly, constantly say that, you know? I'm beginning to think that, you know, submissive means that um, there's something in your life that you're feeling insecure about. You're, you're lacking in your masculinity and you feel, in a way, you kind of feel inferior to other races of men. You know what I'm saying? And I'm beginning to think that, you know, submissive means that um, if you act up, I'm going to get up in your ass. If you act up, I'm, I'm going to beat your ass. I'm going to put my foot up in your ass. That's what that shit means. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, submissive, the whole submissive thing is just scary as fuck to me. If I meet a man and he's sitting there talking about some year, I want my girl to be submissive to me. Run for the fucking hills. Run. Don't deal with that nigga. Because a lot of these men are insecure. And the fact that they need a woman to submit to them, to bow down to them, to be a slave made to them. That just lets you know that he's insecure and you know, one little thing that you do, one little thing that you say is going to upset him. And he might just be the type that when you get home, he's going to put his foot in your ass. He's going to beat your ass. These men are women beaters. You know what I'm saying? Um, And there's this one YouTuber who's this rah, rah, rah type of nigga, you know, he's all about the men. I'm for the men. I'm for the men. We have to get rid, rid of these feminist type of bitches and shit like that. You know, I'm beginning to think that he's a low-down homosexual. That's what he is. He's a homosexual. You know what I'm saying? He's going to ride and die for these men to the day that he's died because he's gay. Come out and just say that you're fucking gay. You know what I'm saying? Um, But, you know, I never liked the word submissive. You know, you can say that I like my woman to be feminine. I like a classy woman. But the word submissive is code for I beat bitches asses. That's what that is, you know. So, you know, you know the women, we're not mad at Fantasia because she said that she wants to submit, that women need to submit to their husbands because we already know what that fucking situation is. You know, you know what I'm saying? We already know what that fucking situation is. You know, a lot of these these bitches out here out here telling the story but it's a whole different thing that's going on behind closed doors that they ain't speaking on you know what i'm saying and that's another thing we got to stop praising everybody's relationships because you don't know what goes on behind closed doors like that nigga could be beating her ass behind closed doors you know that nigga could be threatening her behind closed doors that nigga could be fucking cheating on her behind closed doors you know you know he could be verbally abusive you know I don't never look at somebody and be like, oh, I want to be like them. Oh, I want a relationship like them. Oh, they're goals. You don't know what's going on behind closed doors. You know what I'm saying? 
And for, for the women that are submissive to their husbands and stuff like that, they don't have to come out and say that um, they're submissive to their husbands or you should submit to your husbands. They don't have to, they don't have nothing to prove. You know what I'm saying? Um, but, you know, it's very weird for these black men to be on YouTube saying that they want submissiveness from their women. You know what I'm saying? Because all other races of men, they get a submissive woman, but they're not going on, going on YouTube saying that, yeah, my wife submits to me. She's submissive, miss, submissive to me, you know? It's an insecurity issue, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these black men on YouTube are insecure in their masculinity, and they they see black women as competition, and they know that we don't need their dusty asses, and um, a real man knows what he brings to the table, you know what I'm saying? He don't have to speak on nothing. He ain't got to shout that he's masculine, that he's an alpha male. He ain't got to say all that, you know what I'm saying? That his... his presence speaks for itself so um i'm not intimidated by any of any of these dudes on fucking youtube you know what i'm saying i'm not intimidated i'm not scared of these niggas and i will come on youtube and i will say how i feel i would i will do whatever i want to do on my channel it's my fucking channel i will speak on what i want to fucking speak on it is what the fuck it is it is what the fuck it is you know like i said so um I ain't really want. I wasn't really gonna speak on this fucking topic, but I'm just so fucking tired of hearing these dudes, hearing these fucking black men talking about they want a fucking submissive woman. Okay, and we want masculine men, but we're not ro walking around shouting and shit talking about we need masculine men, we need masculinity, we need a strong man. We're not walking around saying that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? We know real nigga when we see one. And these dudes on YouTube are not real niggas, you know? They're low-down homosexuals. You know, they want to be with men. They hate women. They want to be with a man. You know what I'm saying? That's why they're all for the brothers, the brotherhood, because they're gay. You know, hide behind that shit. So, you know, don't be phased by none of that shit, ladies. Don't be phased by it. All right?